Just gotta be patient and just let Mother Nature do her thing. Brad says their late stop, however, doesn't have anything to do with COVID on his farm. It was more of the weather. Just the past season when COVID really hit hard at first, it was challenging, but we had to just find different ways to sell them. We had to do it for a lot cheaper. I think we're ready for it this year. They're not worried about the quality. They're just worried about how much they're going to get because they're selling out very quickly. You said it is super high. Is this out of the ordinary high for this time? Yes, I mean, as of this week, the price we're at this week, we, um, I believe it's the first time it's ever been this high since, since this has been a business, basically. Turkey Leg Hut is one of the very few places in the city already selling crawfish. However, it is in limited quantities. There's several factors we got going on. One, we're actually having a real winter. Another issue we're having is a lot of farms actually getting workers uh, due to the COVID uh, crisis. How often is Turkey Leg Places like Turkey Lake Getty. I'm trying to get them crawfish almost every every other day. Mm -hmm. uh, normally during this particular time, uh, we'll be getting crawfish every day. Out in Crosby at the Crawfish Shack, they decided to postpone their start date for crawfish due to the overwhelming request of their customers. We go through a massive amount of crawfish, so we need a whole lot of crawfish. We need at least 80 to 100 sacks just to open up our drive-thru. All this crawfish talk has my mouth. Watering. The Crawfish Shack will open next Wednesday, the 27th, and I'm hearing prices from different places that are open around town between $7.50 and $8.95 per pound. So just give it a little time. It's Coco Dominguez reporting from home at Fox 26 News.